Hi, it's me, Kibi, and welcome back to Dredge. In the last episode, we got a new relic. We've helped out the researcher. Um, we discovered new things. Um, we did <laughs> so panic fished ourselves away from the giant squid in the bottom of the center of the islands over here. And I'm excited to see what else is going to happen next. And with that, let's get started. Okay. So first things first, we need to go deliver a relic. So, and then secondly, oh, I can't believe I'm going to say this. We're going to go back to Gale Cliffs <laughs> for two reasons. Two reasons, not because reason number one being that I want to go visit the giant fish that has tormented me for many, 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 many times already. Um, but I do want to, I, uh, ooh. Wait, is this what I need? Yes! Oh my God, we're turning this boat around. Holy moly. We are turning this boat around, going back to the research center. Oh my God. In the last episode, I picked out the wrong fish. It was very similar to my defense. Very similar. But, yeah. Oh my god. I was like, oh, I'll have to come back here to go blow up some stuff and, you know, complete the storyline, blah, blah, blah. And all for that fish. And I don't need to do it. Oh my god. Yay! Hold up about that fish i just so happened to pass it on my way here oh beautiful yeah you, this is this has got to be you hot damn <laughs> i have good news and bad news which do you want to hear give me the bad news first bad news is is the samples you retrieved from the basin have dangerously high counts of cellular mutations okay Good news is that I've honed in on what's causing the abnormalities in the ecosystem. This all points to one thing, that uh, that thing in the basin is harmful to life at a cellular level. It damages everything around it, whether passively or with intent. I need to write up a report on my findings. Sorry, our findings immediately. Maybe now they'll take me seriously. Oh, how rude of me. You've done all this for me, and I've not got much to say thank you uh, with. Um, you should have this. A plan for the future added to the cabin. Okay. She opens up a drawer and pulls out a book. Sheepishly, she hands it to you. This is something I wrote during my studies. I think it will be useful to you. Thanks again for your help. I recommend that you avoid the area. It doesn't seem safe to be near the basin. Oh, wow. Okay. Was that it? Plan for the future. Okay. Yeah. Well, we still gotta come back here anyway, so we can give that lady her rare fish. So, I wanna definitely do that. And then there was, um... I have to remember where I said all those other fish were. Hmm, okay. Anyways. Alright, back to the lighthouse. <laughs> that was awesome. Good for me to be like, Ooh, what is that glowy? Let me find out what that is. And it was the fish that I needed to complete this quest. As I said, we'll be back here um, so I can give the big eel um, to the merchant. Actually, I don't need to blow up the island, the, the blow up that little area around the island. We'll definitely do that. But we are going to go visit 
the dude in the mansion and give him the next relic and see where he wants us to go. Okay, we made it. You walk in and place the jewel encrusted ring on a table by the collector. His eyes widen. We're certainly making excellent progress now, and I know what you're thinking. An item like this would fetch a fortune at my at any auction, but for us its value transcends material wealth. Regardless, you are due a reward. He opens the crimson book, its spine crackling audibly. Selecting a page carefully, he begins excuse me, he begins to read aloud. The words sound muffled, as though he's speaking through a thick haze. Ooh. You hear a growling crackling in your ears. Suddenly your vision flares and both of your eyes pop. He closes the book. We must keep searching. I've been thinking more on where we might find another. I can imagine all manner of detritus swallowed by the silly muck of twisted strands channel. It's worth investigating. I'll mark a location on your map where you can bing, begin your search. Anything else? The words you read? What did you do? What did you do, man? I merely extended his power towards you. Banish. The banishing words will provide you with temporary protection from most things. If spoken swiftly enough, they can be used defensively. Choose your moment carefully. The more they are spoken, the more they are understood. Hmm. Are there any powers you want to know? No. Anything else? Um, no, I think I'm good. You got nothing for me. Um, okay. And we got a ton of stuff to go sell to the, the dude. Um, the dude, I mean. The guy in Little Mario for all the jewels and whatnot. We found quite a bit of trinkets in the last episode. I think it would be worth selling to him. And then we'll go check out the map and see where he wants us to go. Guaranteed it's where <laughs> I accidentally went last time. <laughs> Alright, traitor! Alright, what do you want? We can sell you. Yeah. We can sell you. Yeah. So you yeah. and you. Yeah. How about you? Nice. Look at that. Cool. Now let's go look at the map. Oh. Hmm. The Twisted Strand. We have not been there. Okay. Well, I'm going to sleep it out and go to Gale Cliffs and go pick up the, um, the big eel and some explosives. Yeah. Alright, let's go pick up explosives first. Alright, retired whaler. You. Hi, ah, the house for you. Here we go. Collect item. More explosives. I hope you can put them to good use wherever you find cause for it. Ooh! Oh. Good. Yes. Okay, I'm just gonna buy. You know what? I'm gonna buy two. Put you into storage. 
along with you. And I think that's good for right now. And then I can always come back to him. Alright, what else have I got in here? Nothing. Ugh. We should also do some dredging. I'm gonna pick you up. We'll get you repaired. God, I hate this place. I really do. I hate it. I hate it, I hate it, I hate it, I hate it, I hate it. I know! Yep, 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 yep. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. I'm gonna avoid you! Yay! Into the waterfall! Oh, and I damaged my ball. <laughs> worth it! Worth it! Worth it, worth it, worth it. Okay. Um, fishing? Right here? Okay, start fishing. Ooh! Oh my god, you're huge! This thing's massive! How the hell? Here. God damn it. Oh, if I didn't hit my <laughs> freaking boat, you would fit. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Oh, no, he's going to fit here. He's going to fit here. Crisis averted. Crisis averted. Turn around. All right, here we go. Yeah. I'm leaving. Do I dare? No, I do. No, no. Am I here? Here? Ooh! Engine parts! I need this! Okay, good. Ow! Oh my god, I can't believe I avoided that without <laughs> getting my booty bob too bad. I know. Stop whispering! Uh, leave me alone. Oh no, there goes my light. Yep, 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 yep. I'm already here though. We're good, we're good. Okay. Um. Ooh. Why is everything still. I don't even know what it is. How do I update this pursuit, though? Wait, hold up. Back to rare fish. Port fish to location. Yeah, I gotta go talk to you. Okay, there we go. Traveling yeah. merchant. Hey again. Beth, those rare fish. Mm. I found an ore fish! Great news! Added it to my records. Here, take this. Nice! I can use that. What about the other fish? Great news! I'll add it to my records. 
Where to put the other? Uh, okay, we have it. Okay, back. You want to tell me about? No, no, we're good. I just need to tell the location. I don't even need to get it. Oh man! All right, whatever. Well, we'll sell this bad boy. <laughs> Two hundred and fifty-three. Holy moly! Okay. Nice. Okay, and then we're going to put you into storage. Not that I'm trying to test fade or anything. Did I not drop my crap pots? I didn't drop my crap pots. Oh. Oopsie poopsies. That's fine. Okay. Oh, who are you? Your trumpeted figure, swathed in dark blue robes, their faces barely visible. Fishermen, please help. You can barely hear their rasping whisper above the wind and waves. The fill, the hunger. A hooded figure unfurls an old paper scroll. They point to a shape at the top. It appears to be a blue mackerel. Okay. I don't have a blue mackerel. You need a blue mackerel? Maybe I do a blue mackerel. They're relatively easy. Alright, let's get you a blue mackerel and see what you gotta say. I should also change out my rods for that. Because I need a shallow for that. Okay. The lighthouse keeper approaches you on the dock, wearing a questioning expression. You must have been around at most of the islands by now. Have you found whatever it is you're looking for? Uh, I'm just fishing. She recoils from your flagrant lie. <laughs> Why do you mistrust me so? Why haven't? What have I done to warrant such suspicion? She turns from you, shaking her head and muttering. She heads back towards the lighthouse. You guys, you've been so nasty to me, lady. Okay. Okay. Into storage. Um, and then I'm going to uninstall you. Put you into storage. All right. Darn. <laughs> I know. Oof. Oh my gosh. Oh, I got so much. Oh, there's my rod. Um. I definitely have to drop all those crab pots. Um. And some of that wood. We can get rid of this. Um. Alright, first let's go back and put you in. Um, to cargo. Install. And then let's go back and put my coastal back in. Very good. Um, and then... Put on the dry dock. Ooh. I am ready. 
proceed to purchase. More rods, more rod space. Ugh. I didn't stall. And then we're gonna put you into storage. Uh, uninstall. Put you into storage. And now, I should be able to fit you! And you are everything that I could possibly ever want. Can I fit? Oh, okay, you fit here? Yeah, you do. Nice! Sweet! And this is oceanic. Nice, this is so good. Okay. Smears. Okay. New rod. Want a blue mackerel? Alright, let's get this blue mackerel to this dude. Better than I've changed your mind on needing and or wanting a blue mackerel. <gasps> Alright. To fill the hunger. Okay. Boop. There you go. With expert precision, they plunge their hands through the gullet of the fish and tear it apart. They stuff it into their mouth unceremoniously. More still. Empty. They point to another shape on a second scroll. A tiger mackerel. I haven't seen that yet. Okay. We will find you a tiger mackerel. When we do. Um, it's early enough. So. Um, okay. Wherever you are, dude. Figure it out. Alright, we're gonna do some fishing for the rest of the day. And then we're gonna try to figure out Ooh. Grass. We're gonna try to figure out where the the new destination is for the relic. Okay, map. Um, let's actually first let's get out into the water first and then figure out where I need to go. Because we all know I have terrible sense of direction. Absolutely terrible sense of direction. Okay, so we need to go in this direction to the left. That's the devil spawning. <laughs> We're already wasting so much time. So much time. Okay. That's because I can't figure out where the fudge nuggets I want to go or how to like navigate any of this. I think this is right. I don't know, we'll figure it out. It never gets old. Never, ever, 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 ever gets old. I love it. Anything that looks like a building. Ooh, it's foggy out here. Oh no.
This looks promising. This looks... Oh, yes! You're my girl! Hi! Uh, yeah. Ah! Hey! <laughs> hey again! Come back for a chat? Why can you tell me about Twisted Strand? Not much, to be honest. I've gone inside just once. I sailed into the lagoon bes behind us and saw I could go left, right, go straight ahead. Something about the place seemed off. Through the fog, it looked like the trees were moving. I can't explain it. I turned around and sailed right back out. It sound I sometimes I uh, use this spot to rest up for a few days. The sunrise are particularly striking though. The haze. Never do any regular business here, of course. Is there anything else you want to talk about? No. Alright, we're gonna snooze. I'm gonna wanna check this out during the day. Let's see what we're dealing with here. Oh, God. What the hell? the heck? Message in a bottle. Added to cabin. You don't even know what. Stop it! No! 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 Oh. What is this? Okay. He's a fish. A gray mullet. A sergeant fish. Okay, getting out. I'm already panicking. Ooh. Oh my god. I don't look on your face. <laughs> Too long in the open water, eh? Uh, yeah. Um, here's all my fish. Um, we're gonna see that out. Wow. Everything got so creepy. What is this? A vortex? Okay. It's over here. And we got another weird creepy boat. What was that? Ooh, research part. Nice. Jeez, I hate those guys. Okay. What about over here? Oh wait, I don't need this. 
Engine? No. this okay anything you're not gonna jump up at me all right Okay. Oof. Oop, sorry. <laughs> I'm apologizing to her boat. <laughs> oh, I'll get ready to get some again. Okay. Um, here we go, so... Dog tags. Storage. Okay. Let's do some research. Let's start working on that engine! Okay. No fish. Another plane. This is like the Bermuda Triangle. Okay, got it. Thank you. Ay, ay, ay. Approach a hooded figure, deep violet robes, mask my face completely. Fisherman, feed. The person appears to be. Uh, rest what they were about to say. Feed the girl. The hooded figure reveals a scroll gesture to the picture. Is this is what I got? There you go. I held the fish up in the face, it was tightening grip. A few seconds, the fish collapses in on itself under pressure. The figure looks through the gory mess and picks out the heart, placing it onto their tongue. Sustain the mind. They show you another scroll. Horseshoe crab. Hmm. Oh, I do have crab pots. We do have crab pots that I forgot to <laughs> deploy back over at Gale Cliff. So maybe we can try to. Oh god. Um. Where is she? Where's my lady? No. She's the other way, I think. Ooh. Oh, Jesus. That's the lighthouse. Where are you? Oh my god. Can't find you. Ah, oh, there. It's that red ominous, ominous glow. Oh, there you are. There you are. My little salvation. <laughs> salvation! I know, I know, I know. 
Okay. Crabots. <laughs> That's what I was saying. Wait, do I have anything? No, we're gonna put you in. Mm-mm-mm. Crap pot. Let's try over here. Over here. God, I hate all of this. Things like following me. Oh. Maybe I have to also probably use this defense mechanism. Is it banish? Evil spirits. This is the zoom zoom. The manifest. Black horn and what makes them? Your presence known. Okay. Very close look to identify the fishing spots in the area. I haven't tried that. Ooh. This lady's also navigated like all these borders too. It's crazy. Ugh. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I don't want to go back to the little tropical island that I was in. <laughs> that was so much better. It's... Oh, leave me alone. What is this? Nothing? God, leave me alone! Making me panic. <laughs> Jesus. Nice, here we go. Okay. And then let's go back to the island where that guy was.
Hello, I'm back. Back, I'm back, I'm back. No, not you. I learned my lesson before. Thank you, was over here. There you are. Sustain the mind. Okay, where's your crab? The figure turns, expose its soft underbelly. They scoop out its innards with sharp fingernails, consuming them blindly. Consume the sky. The figure slowly reveals the final scroll. You want a barrel eye. Okay. Alright. I'm going to find where that is. I'm assuming it's probably over here somewhere. So what? I'm going to end it here. Um. So we kind of got a, a little taste of what is happening inside of this stranded area. Um, there is something that is totally creating more panic. Um, so I'm like losing a lot of life. So I got to figure out like how to maneuver that. Um, in the next episode, I think I also want to try to go back to the Devil's Spine and solve that mystery over there because I definitely have all the the right equipment um so I I think I may need to upgrade my boat before I can come back to over here so that's kind of like what I'm thinking anyways I hope you're enjoying the gameplay I hope you're enjoying the story as much as I am um I would like to encourage you to go ahead and subscribe to my little growing little YouTube community um, I would love to have you as part of it. So uh, until the next one, toodles. <laughs>